Hey everyone, and welcome back to another video on Lumber Capital Log Yard. Today is day five of operating the new LT70, and we're cutting railroad ties. And that just got me thinking, how fast can I cut railroad ties on this new mill? Today, we're going to find out. So without further ado, let's get into the video. When you're cutting railroad ties, there's the fast way to do it and then the not so fast way. The quick way is just to make four cuts and then boom, you're done. The only problem with that is that if it's a larger log, then you're throwing a lot away. And I do know some places that do that, like the Amish. I don't really know what they do with those huge slabs, but as you guys know, we are a zero waste strategy business, so we try to do that as little as possible. Not that we're throwing the slabs away anyhow, that of course will be used for firewood, but you don't want to take off some huge slab if you don't have to. So today we're going to be doing it, well, the not so quick way, and that's making extra cuts. So instead of just making four cuts, which is the quickest way, we're gonna be adding extra cuts, taking off flitches, which is okay because that's actually where the money is at. It's in the higher quality boards that come off in the flitches. A lot of the flitch pile I'm looking at right now, they're, it's clear lumber, which is either going to be sent to Bingman's or Storybook, but of course you get a lot more for that than a railroad tie. So, like I said, we're not going to be just taking off a huge slab and making as little cuts as possible. I'm actually going to make as many cuts as possible to get as many flitches as possible so we're not wasting anything. <sighs> then that leaves me to the unfortunate part about that, which is then you're not gonna make a railroad tie in three minutes. And you hear some places do that. They're like, oh yeah, I can make a railroad tie in three minutes. Well, that's a four cut situation. And like I said, I don't really know how they do that because it's rare that you'd get a hundred logs that are all exactly the same size and are perfect for that. Um, I wish it was like that, but I, I don't know. It's not like that here. So all of these logs are a little bit different size. I'll be taking one cut more or one cut less off of each one, just depending here. But that's okay because like I said, that's also, you know, you're gonna get more money for it that way anyhow. So it might take us more like five minutes. I'm thinking five minutes, I don't really know. We're going to try that out today. I'm kind of curious to see just how quick we can do it um, on this mill. I'm gonna try and cut as quick as possible. I'm still trying to get used to this mill, of course. Keep on pushing the wrong button. The joysticks are really easy. Your brain just picks that up really quick. I always push the wrong button though and then I have to start over. Whatever, okay, I'm not gonna be too hard on myself. It's only day five, but we're gonna roll on this first log and get rolling and once I start rolling, I'm not stopping, so keep up.
Whoa, okay, so a few things. First off, that first log took five cuts and the second one took six cuts. So we ended up taking off less boards than I thought we were going to, but they were the smaller logs on the deck here today. This one here on the mill bed is probably going to take us some more cuts because it is a little bit larger. But hey, it took us like, what, four minutes to do that, which is pretty good. I was hoping for five, but I was thinking it was gonna be more like six minutes. Hey, four minutes? I'm not complaining. That is actually pretty sweet. Um, I, I'm impressed, actually, with myself. No, <laughs> I'm kidding. Somebody needs to pour some water on my head, so it's hot head, right? Anyhow, wow, Jade was able to keep up with that. I was a little worried, because I'm like, Jade, I'm going to go fast. Hopefully you're ready for this. And uh, she did. So. Wow, I'm just impressed with this mill and I can't believe it because when we were trying to do railroad ties on the other mill, the situation was that we just could not mill it fast enough for it to be worth it to us. It was took more like 10 minutes. That's a huge difference. That's like double. It's about what I thought, you know. Um, this mill runs about double what the other one did for sure. So, wow. Anyhow, I'm speechless. <laughs> That's it for today's video, everyone. I hope that you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Also, check out our merch shop. I'll leave a link to it down in the description. We have tons of Carhartt hoodies, jackets, other stuff, funny t-shirts, bunch of cool stuff on there. Just check it out. Other than that, we'll see you back here next time. Bye.